Jen, thank you. 502. Happening today, we're expecting to learn more about the legal action to address the opioid crisis in Virginia. Attorney General Mark Herring visited Hampton Roads earlier this month to talk about the impact of the epidemic. And today, he'll announce what his office is doing about it during a speech in Richmond. Our Kiana Patterson joins us live now in the newsroom with more details. Kiana? Good morning, Katie and Don. Herring will meet with state leaders this afternoon to talk about the progress we've made with the opioid crisis here in the state and also what's next. Herring says that he's motivated by parents whose children have overdosed and also people recovering. And the Department of Health says six of seven cities right here in Hampton Roads have seen a decrease in overdose deaths. The only city to see an increase from 2016 to 2017 was Portsmouth. And Herring says he wants to continue to teach people about addiction and remove the stigma. This is something that can happen to anyone and it has its roots in the medicine cabinet more so than out on the streets because you know it can be a sports injury, an auto accident, uh, you know a, a, a surgery where legitimate prescriptions for pain are prescribed and soon the patient develops an, an addiction and because these drugs are so powerful. And the meeting begins today at 1 o'clock in Richmond, but coming up in just 30 minutes, he'll explain how he's working to crack down on drug dealers. In the newsroom, Kiana Patterson, 10 on your side.